And this is just a love-hate relationship. I love competition, but I hate it at the same time. I love the process of it. Progress, you see. Like, I'm addicted to it, to be honest. They don't even know what's coming, man. If someone beats me, I'll go up to them, give them a handshake, and be like, yo, you earned that shit. Because, like, man, I'm fucking working hard. So we are four weeks. Round two. Final close down. Drink all the water. Done. Got my 3D. Oh yeah. It's go time, baby. So as soon as I woke up, it's like 9:30. Two liters of water. I'm gonna cut my water at. 12. I'm gonna try to get another liter in, so three liters. I'm gonna have breakfast right now, starting with just straight up oatmeal, cup and a half of oatmeal, and I don't think there's any oatmeal. Yeah, I'll just have it with water and then one scoop of protein powder. My oversized bowl of oatmeal. Time to crush it. Doesn't even look like I have a tan. Um, with this tan, actually, you have to like shower in the morning rinse it off and then we go for the secondary tan. I've never actually had to rinse it off before, but I guess that's just what you gotta do with this one. Secondary tan, 250, and then I'm probably gonna try to stay in the city. I don't know. Cause and then we have to come all the way back to Lockport and then go back to the city to be there for 6.30. It is finally time to go. I feel like the day has just been dragging on and I've been doing literally nothing but thinking about just getting a pump and getting on stage. But now it's time to go get my tan. So things are kinda Move it. And then we're gonna go to Miranda's after. We're gonna go my pre-workout pump mix. My meal for later, which has just two cups of rice, soy sauce, and turkey bacon. So they're not actually supplying us with pump up equipment. So I'm gonna use these tens and then I also have a band. Put you beep in. Second tan, this is where I should get like a darker face too. I think they do like the whole entire thing. And then uh, we're gonna go back to Miranda's, get our meal in, and then hopefully everything runs smoothly with the show. We get here, we pump up, Phoebes takes the footage, and it just ends up being a good show. Like, yeah, there's not too much more to film from here. Phoebes is gonna probably do the rest, so. Thank you guys for coming along for this journey. Like it's been crazy, it's been a grind. I've loved every single second of it. Like honestly making this content kept me accountable. It motivated me and I just hope it inspires some of you guys. Anyways, thanks a lot. See you guys soon. Look, denim stains on my wide three belt, bitch. Money made my whole damn self switch. Ain't like this is shit I take to heaven or hell with. Ain't from the sea market, but my ass getting selfish. Still I'm on a way up. some pumpkin pie cookie and then I stole this from Miranda's house. That's all I'm gonna have. I don't need anything else. So last year I had too much stuff and then it just didn't, uh, didn't go well. I'm trying to tr treat it as if I'm going to the gym, you know? Like would I have a bunch of random shit? Like this is already more than I would have before the gym. So. And then pre-workout pump product. It's already in here mixed up. And I'm also gonna take three pills of creatine. So that's the setup right there. That's what's gonna get me first place. It's right there. <laughs> it's not even the physique, it's just this stuff. Yeah. Bro, but the thing is, look at what look at what I have to use for pump up. A band and 10 pounders. Like how the fuck am I gonna get pumped? You'll get a pump, bro. You'll be fine. I'm telling you, if you don't get overall, bro, I got you. I'll go up the stage. <laughs> no, do it. If I don't get overall, I want you to go on the stage. Whoever does get it, just take them and choke slam them. It's like, nah. It's for Dylan. Yeah, exactly. Fuck this whole thing. Hold the Kanye West. Go up yeah. there, grab the mic, and be like, you know what? I don't think this guy deserves it. This guy's been, you know, Dylan over here, number 115, has been working real hard and shit. And then just walk out. Is that your number? 
115. Yeah, I can't really scream, bro. I was telling Kaylin, I'm like, you gotta do all the cheering for me. Because, oh like, if I'm gonna pull a camera out. Yeah, 115. Ooh. Let's go. We'll be the voices. Yeah, I told yeah. you. Let's you know what's scream. funny? I told <laughs> So it's, it's Carlos's first time, right? Getting yeah. a tan. Yeah. So uh, this is for touch-ups, right? Yeah. And I told you, I like Carlos, do you know what that's for? And he's like, no. And I'm like, it's for wiping your butt in case you get like tan on it. And he looked at me, he's like, he's like, really? And I'm like, no, you <laughs> idiot. <laughs> he actually, he, he believed me at first. And I was just like, no. Poor Carlos. <laughs> <laughs> I can't confuse though. Messing with him. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Bro, <laughs> 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 she drove me here for a reason. An hour? An hour and 15 still. Yeah, because the show is at 6... 7.30? 7.30. I thought it got switched to 6... Well, they wanted the athletes here earlier. Oh, okay. But the show is still going to start show at 7.30. The show at 7.30. Oh, okay. Maybe they'll start it earlier. I think they're trying to make it move faster. Well, uh, they probably realized from like the first show that it moved. <laughs> and they probably want to get everything organized, have everybody like ready in here. Because with the last show, they were trying to tell bikini competitors to mm -hmm. come. Mm -hmm. And they were still at home. Oh. Because they were moving so fast that they were like still waiting for them to come to the mm -hmm. actual venue. Oh. Because that's the time that they were supposed to be here. But they were oh. moving way too fast. Oh, so that's why they bumped you guys back. That's why they told us to come earlier, just in case it moves as fast as the last show. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I finally ended up weighing myself, because I haven't weighed myself pretty much the entire prep. Um, while I was carb depleting, I was actually 159, which was my lowest. And then I just uh, weighed myself at Miranda's, and it was 162 pounds. So that's what I'm stepping on stage at. 162 pounds, which is my heaviest ever for stage weight. I think last time I went on stage, I was 158. So four pound increase, which is solid. Like that's amazing. If I can keep on doing that every single year, then I'm in the clear. Why won't you go get you a dollar or something? Don't hang with a who line for nothing. I see that we different, you ride and I dump them. I don't do discussions, on bragging about hundreds. Don't go to your places, I know that they sunken. Don't call me your brother, I barely could trust you. I talk to a shorty, she bagging the bucket. And I'ma need all of my dollars. Wow, wow. Thank you,
Yo, we fucking did it. All the hard work, those five weeks of literally zero cheat meals, every single day, cardio sessions, workouts, not a single day, not a single session missed, and we got it. We actually have to do a drug test. So I think it's if you win the overall, you have to do a drug test. I'm not 100% sure. Do you have to do it if you win just your class? Overall. Just overall. Okay, so just overall, you do the drug test. Um, I think it's just a piss test. And then we're good. Do you guys provide water to drink? We do, yeah. Do you want Yay. Water? Yes, please. I'm so dehydrated. Perfect. Optimally, the second line, I need 45 ml at most. Second line? Okay. Yeah. Sweet. Okay. Just peeing it? Yep. Uh, don't flush the toilet. Hi. Thank you. Thank you. Women's right. Wellness Master. Yeah. How are you doing? Good. How are you? Pretty good. Are you coming for the big prize? Yeah, overall. Oh, congratulations. This one? Or over there? Okay. Here, I'll just slip this one over your arm. Okay, okay. thank you. Oh my god, I'm probably you gonna have put the camera there. down. Probably, yeah. Oh no, okay, can I just show them what it is? <laughs> yes. Okay. So what is it, metal? Oh my god, and trophy. What's this? Protein. Holy crap. A bag full of supplements and another bag full of supplements. Another bag? This one. On your back. Oh, oh <laughs> yeah. I forgot about that one. Yeah, I already did. I'm so excited. I'm so out of it right now. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. Wait, what is it? Let's fucking go! Let's go! <laughs> it's crazy when you put all the fucking work in, everything you have, like, Phoebes was there for the whole journey, he saw it, like, yes, it sir. was a non-stop grind. Every week, I was looking different. Every time I was home, I didn't mess up once, like, it's just crazy how it works out when you just give it your all. This is the end of the competition prep which is kind of sad because I actually love this shit and I love having Phoebes doing this like whole editing and just keeping me accountable and giving you guys inspiration and motivation like it's been amazing and I hope I know this channel is like small right now but we're growing and one day we'll be looking back at this shit and being like god damn like this is where we started and uh, we're putting the work in now we're gonna keep on putting the work in I just want to thank you guys for just supporting the channel I hope this like inspires you motivates you whatever some type of value but like me and Phoebes like it's not just me like he's putting work behind the camera like doing all these edits we're trying to give you guys the best damn content like we have a small channel and we're making content that is better than some of these fucking top influencers it's crazy there's people who have way more subs that don't even put half the work in that we're doing it so I know it's just a matter of time and if you guys are working on something it's just a matter of time just keep putting the working, be patient, don't ever give up. Consistency fam. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> Let's fucking go, bro. Yo, give me that. Are we still filming? Yeah, we are. Yo. Yeah. Any last words? 
Uh, all I'm saying is I'm coming for Dylan next year. Y'all <laughs> better watch. No, uh, fuck man. I don't know what to say, but shit, that shit was a long four weeks, even though it felt so short. And I'm just proud of you, bro. Thanks, I'm just bro. Proud of you, man. I saw how much work you put in, and I told you every week I fucking saw you. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? Every time I saw your fucking body, I'm like, uh. Like, you know what I mean? Like, and you fucking well deserved, man. Yeah. Like, Yo, thanks, bro. All that work you put in, well deserved, bro. Thank you guys for tuning in. We got more coming. I'm telling you, we coming. Let's we coming. go. Let's go. <laughs>